Are you ready for UFC 300? The anticipation is palpable as we gear up for an evening packed with pulse-pounding, adrenaline-fueled action. Tonight, the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas transforms into a battleground where legends are made and champions are crowned. In the main event, we have the light heavyweight title fight with current champion Alex Pereira squaring off against former champion Jamahal Hill. Pereira, a former kickboxing champion, has a record of 9 wins and 2 losses. Meanwhile, Hill, with his record of 12 wins, 1 draw, and 1 loss, is a former champion who relinquished his title due to an injury. This is a fight that promises to be a clash of titans, a test of strength, skill, and willpower. The co-main event sees the women's strawweight champion Zheng Weili defending her title against Yan Xiaonan. Both fighters are known for their technical skills and aggressive styles, making this a potential fight of the night contender. But that's not all. We also have Justin Gaethje going head-to-head -head with Max Holloway in a fight that promises to be a thrilling spectacle. And we can't forget about Charles Oliveira and Armin Sarukyan, two fighters known for their relentless pace and ferocious finishing abilities. Now, let's delve into the play-by-play -play of the main events. In the light heavyweight title fight, Pereira and Hill went toe-to-toe, -to -toe, showcasing their striking prowess. Pereira, known for his kickboxing background, utilized his powerful kicks to keep Hill at bay. Meanwhile, Hill, known for his striking power, landed significant blows that tested the resilience of Pereira. It was a back-and-forth battle, a chess match of striking where each fighter had their moments. In the co-main event, Zheng Weili and Yan Xiaonan put on a technical masterclass. Both fighters showed their striking and grappling skills, with Zheng using her wrestling to control the fight and Yan countering with her striking. It was a closely contested fight that kept everyone on the edge of their seats. The fight between Gethia and Holloway was a war. Both fighters threw caution to the wind and engaged in a brawl that had the crowd on their feet. Gethia's power met Holloway's volume, creating a thrilling back and forth that had everyone gasping for breath. Finally, Oliveira and Sarukyan put on a grappling clinic. Both fighters showcased their submission skills, with Oliveira using his Brazilian jiu-jitsu and Sarukyan countering with his sambo. It was a battle of wills, a test of who could impose their game plan first. In summary, UFC 300 delivered on its promise of high-octane action. From the main event to the prelims, every fight was a testament to the skill, determination, and heart of each fighter. Whether it was the striking clinic put on by Pereira and Hill, the technical showcase from Zhang and Yan, the war between Gaithia and Holloway, or the grappling masterclass from Oliveira and Saruk Yan, UFC 300 proved why it is the pinnacle of combat sports. Tonight, we witness champions defend their crowns, challengers rise to the occasion, and fighters leave it all in the octagon. Each fight was a story, a battle of wills, a testament to the spirit of competition. This is what UFC 300 was about, this is what MMA is all about, and this is why we love this sport.